target audience? My topic is school starting later yeah. instead of like 7.30 mm -hmm. and my audience is wavering and I'm mainly talking to like parents and soon to be parents basically. Okay, sounds good. Hey parents and soon to be parents, yeah. please welcome Kira Goggins. Woo! So how many of you want nothing but the best for your children or just in general want them to eventually one day go to college? Well, what do you think of the ways for them to get to college? You know, receive good grades and do their homework and turn in on time, which or you know, even getting scholarships. Children nowadays in high school have been linked to physical, psychological, and educational problems. They've also been linked to sleep deprivation. Sleep deprivation is when they have stress in their daily life or when it comes to treating certain activities for sleep, such as doing more work or just saying, hey, I want to hang out with my friends instead of actually going to sleep. When you have sleep deprivation, it, the, the, the results of having it are decreased performance and alertness, memory and cognitive impairment, and occupational and automobile injuries, which is all needed for school. So tell me, don't you care about your child's health and safety when driving to school or just in general getting sleep to be able to get a good grade on that test? Some of you may be wondering, what are the causes to not getting enough sleep? Well, some of them may be activities such as doing a sport, like maybe finishing their game and having a championship, or doing the homework and studying for that last test that's in the morning. It could also just be in general from stress, because you know your child is maybe doing sports and is trying to get that scholarship that you know that they want so badly. The National Sleep Foundation found that 60% of kids under the age of 18 have said that they have complained about being tired. 15% even have been found that adolescents have said that they've fallen asleep at school. Dr. Mark Mulhall states that older adolescents need more sleep than younger ones, which in this theory is true because older adolescents fall asleep later in the day and also wake up later in the day because they need the full cycle of sleep, which is needed of eight to 10 hours. So why should you want this for your kid? You might be thinking, my kid's probably used to it. Well, it also increases their movement and get their full cycle, and they're able to have more energy that is needed at the end of the day, such as doing the practice or doing the homework that's needed. It also helps them put them in a better mood at the end of the day. A professor of human behavior named Hartscan states everyone needs to have full energy to be able to learn. Because if you don't have your energy when you're learning during school, it's basically like you didn't learn at all. It's going through one ear and going out the other. So it's basically like you didn't learn. The results of having this thing done, of having school start later, uh, risk they reduce the risk of drowsy sleeping, which is falling asleep on the wheel and causing an injury. And a school in Minneapolis, in Minnesota did this named Minneapolis Public School. They changed their school time to 7.15 to 8.40. And the results of doing this they found were a higher percentage of attendance, and they saw improvement in alertness in their students, and they also gave some of their students a poll over who were alerted to being depressed, and they, their numbers of that went lower. Um, it also helped improve their test scores, which was really good for Minnesota for them. And the parents of who were in the Minnesota County also had said that they reported their children were a lot more easier to live with, which we all know nowadays, teenagers have their moments. In conclusion, full energy is needed for your children to be able to live their full potential. I challenge you to talk to your school board or administration and tell them what is needed to be done in order to have their children be able to see the full potential needed for their school. Even just a little bit of time can go a long way for your child no matter what. Thank you.